Hey guys, I'm back with Jade Empire and we're ready to go on to the next area. So basically we need to go back to the area we were at before. And we can just exit then. I might just get through there. So I'll just go around here. I don't need to look at those. And we're heading to the actual last area of chapter 3. Which is nice. So, it's up this way, is the way to the area. Doop doop. Right. So, you get here. I don't actually know where that leads. But, uh, we're going... Or is this the place? Uh, okay. Looks like a way back after we finish. So, it looks like we are going this way. And round, okay. Very sly. Was that sagacious zoo ahead? I know he wouldn't leave us, but what is he doing sneaking in there? Keep a careful eye out. He may be in need of our help. Open everyone, apparently. Right. I do not like this place. Even compared to the rest of the necropolis, this is a dark and troubled place. Well, we're going in here anyway. But first I'm going to read this. And there's nothing else I can get here. So let's go inside. In we go. Okay. Blessing board. Well... Oh, let's click leave in case there is anything else around here. Nope. Now I've got to open it again. <laughs> Alright, so let's let's go and enter here. Looks like a nice place, doesn't it? Ah I was told to expect a new recruit, and you fit the description. Well done, braving the necropolis. A troublesome walk, but it weeds out the weak. I am the Watcher, and this is the fortress of the Lotus Assassins. It was built amid the graves of a thousand generations, the tomb of the Emperor at its core. Okay. Now, I will show you to the Hall of Induction. If you have servants, they will be allowed to accompany you, but you are responsible for their actions. So I believe there was a romancing uh, thing that I missed out on, but, oh well. Because I'm not currently romancing the anyone, the I think. Order of the Lotus, I don't know how it works. The Lotus assassins are an I don't really care. Emperor, as dictated by Death's Hand, and implemented by Grand Inquisitor Gia. Gia, yay! Thanks to we know her. We are becoming the face of power in the Empire. The Imperial Army will soon be stationed only at taverns and fish markets. Well, the Great shit. Golem <laughs> Army constructed here will spread across the Empire. Our masters will be all-powerful. You will assist if you survive. Weak recruits die quickly. Okay. Master Gang is one of our trainers. He will be your master as you seek to become an assassin. He is harsh, but his knowledge will be invaluable to you. You will find him at the opposite end of the Hall of Induction, near the entrance to the Central Chambers. Do not keep him waiting. Well, I'm not going to ask him anything. Do not keep him waiting. The far end of the Hall, at the entrance to the Central Chambers. Simple enough. Hopefully service under Master Gong will lead us to the information we need. We knew about the Golems, but is Death's Hand or the Emperor behind it all? And save game. Right. I don't think there is even anything down here. Oh, the guy's going back that way. Ah. Uh, I guess that's the way out anyway, so let's go around here then. Jar! Oh, okay. Uh, there's a focus shrine up here if you need it. 
I don't. They look purple on the map. Alright, so let's go down here. Kop awuka inir u afawafi ithaturo turo uk. And of course we get a fight right off the bat. With the rise of the golems, we acolytes have fewer opportunities to serve. You are unwelcome. Yeah, I'm kind of, you know, wanting to join here. Okay. We are losing status to the golem army, and you want to take more attention away from us? I think you need to prove your worth. We have nothing to prove Fine. <laughs> oh well. Kauru su ir tata si ir uyu. Pearson si ir no u kupki tir sun urk. Okay, fine. Uki ruk fir nir niki pra. Let's see how long this lasts. This one did. More blood to stain my hands. A badge of honor. You ain't nice, did. Oh, god damn it. Fuck you. Jesus. Just comes out of nowhere with a fucking attack right away. Fucking decapitate your ass. Yeah. Okay. I think that was pretty obvious what would happen there. Oh well. Oh, it's this guy. How's it going? So, there is no discouraging you. You have come to the heart of the assassins, and you already have enemies. Are you certain you are ready for what you will learn here? Yeah. I don't think the <laughs> voice is yours anymore. This is my realm where my demons hide. You will be forced to see them. You have shown little interest in my warnings, but now you will see. Okay. Whose side is worthy of having me? Is your motivation so clear now that you walk these halls? Go. Your new master is waiting. Secure a place near the heart of the assassins, and you will be near your goal. Grand Inquisitor Shia is key. Fuck that bitch. I don't know what to make of Zoo. He seems so tormented. Well. Uh, okay. That's a golem. Uh, uh, this guy here. Kia Jong. Ukia Kupa Bithita Soki Kustan Fatiwe Ia Kune Usote Tate here? Yes. Let's say I say why buy son. Oh, if I yeah, Oksonko no go isansia. So if you say that you know a kiamen, a koni uk no we a kup sa ya sisi ya su ukot. And uh, tell him that. She's fine. Oh, if I yeah, or some cop no go is on here. Now you have to get this one right as well. <laughs> Spectacular girl. It's this one here because she had her hair in knots. Who could eat a simple no? Sathwa kawa ear if yak. Yes. Ika kahia wo no kahia ear wo shathi. Well, at least we can check out what he has. And not much, honestly. But yeah, he, he doesn't have shit. Uh, at least I can go there, though. So, now we're looking for the guy at the end here. And there is a spirit font here if you need it. Oop. This guy! You are falling behind, gang. Grand Inquisitor Zia is not happy, therefore I am not happy. If your work does not improve, I will have to stop taking credit for it. The latest battalion of golems stand idle because of you. If the production of the Jade Golem is delayed again, perhaps your soul will fuel our next attempt. 
I trust I have made myself clear. Yes, Master Shin. I thought so. Do not let anything delay you further. It would be a shame to once more remind Grand Inquisitor Jia how incompetent you are. Yes, an absolute shame. Okay. What do you want? So help me, if you're just some wandering slave, I'll have you butchered to color the clay golems. Wait, no. You are the one I was told to expect. A new recruit. <laughs> As if I don't have enough trouble watching over the other fools in my care. Well, I'm gonna do the best, best I guess. The limit of what we expect, despite what you have achieved elsewhere. You will be reconstructed into the perfect obedient slave. If Sounds survive, nice. Then you will be an assassin. For now, you are a Lotus Acolyte, and your life expectancy is not long. Follow me down to the central chambers when you are ready to begin your indoctrination. Do not keep me waiting. A battalion of golems stand idle. Right. So, I... What the fuck? Right, so I think I need to go down this way. Right? Or no. Looks like I am taking the door. Okay. And doop doop. If we go down here, I believe there is eventually some stuff you can get down here in the lower chamber. So I don't want to talk to him right. Or uh, apparently I'm going to. Or I'll get a cutscene, okay. Oh, this guy just getting killed. Awesome. Fuck. Damn the heavens for the fools I lead. I am destined to suffer for their incompetence, and I have one man to blame for it. Shin. The old scorpion had one of his followers shatter a spirit shard during training. There are ghosts everywhere. I've lost eight slaves and three acolytes to them. You, new blood, get over there and occupy those ghosts until I can get real Lotus assassins to clean them up. Golem production cannot be delayed by this. That does not sound like an order you were meant to survive. Nope. Go on. It's your first sacrifice for your new life. I'm sure it will be glorious. Well, he gave us that, but, uh... Did I take a wrong turn or sub? Oh, no. There is an area here. Where you get a bunch of shit. And probably a lot of, um... Experience as well, honestly. This gives you the configuration, or apparently you can only read so many of them. Uh, right, okay, I think I got everyone here, and I leveled up as well. Uh, I'll put a few into body, and I'll put one in one. So I've got fucking 75, jeez, man. Should put some in paralyzing palm. Pam. Yeah. I'll do that. Uh, anything in here? It's not quite it. Did. Right. I'm going to check these other two rooms. Oh, what's that in here? Nothing. Did I really just get nothing? Okay. And there are a guy in here. Okay, so we're going over to... I gave you an order, Acolyte. Yes. Go spill your new blood on those ghosts while I get some real assassins in here. It's over here, I think, yeah. Right, so you, you have some golems that are inactive, and you have some ghosts here. Who are not inactive. But, uh, yeah, there's one lost... What were they called again? Lost ghosts or something? Something like that. They're, they're relatively annoying, but not too bad. Oh, and uh, move, move, and roll in. Okay. What were they called again? Ghost Lords or something? I don't know. Yes, that was it. All I know is these guys take like forever to kill, man.
Like, why, why do we need this guy? What the hell? Well, I should be getting a new martial arts style, thank god. After I complete this area and go into the arena again, which I need to clear up. I also need to clear the furnace place up. Yeah, like 500 XP. Um, soul extractor room. Can I even go in there yet? No. Uh, to check this vase. Just, just, let's just chill in there. Right, that should be it, I think. Well, at least that's what you need to do first. Let's go talk to him again. You, you live. And the ghosts are gone? Well, I did not expect this. It would seem that I have a competent acolyte for once. Interesting. Recruits are rarely of use before we strip them of their outside identities, but you beg a more interesting application. Could you be the one I have waited for? I guess. Your duties would normally include a period of deprivation in a cell until every hint of self and identity was stripped away. It is a draining, brutal awakening. I need a favored protege, someone willing to risk everything in my service. I will preserve your intellect, allow your inventive mind to remain, in exchange for two tasks. One is your duty anyway. The other is something to secure your future at the heart of the Assassins. Lotus Acolytes are utterly expendable. You deserve better. Okay. So, I, you must operate I'm pretty sure any response will get you to get through this, but you will help some are ruthless rather than others. Empire's glorious Golem Army. <laughs> And golems. golems are fueled by the souls of the dead. The recently dead, it turns out, make far more obedient and powerful golems, especially if brutally killed. We no longer mine the necropolis for souls that linger near their resting place. We butcher slaves instead and extract their souls into spirit shards. That's nice. Tonight we require a shard of exceptional quality for a jade golem that will control the latest battalion of golems. You will oversee this in the extraction chamber. Okay. You clearly deserve better than the short life of a regular acolyte. Your ability surprised me. Use it to surprise the others as well. Help me gain the power to help you. Kill Master Shin, my superior. Oh, okay. Well... Okay. No. Losing an exceptionally talented servant like you is of no benefit to me. Even if acolytes are expendable, they die often in the machinations between masters. You're just fodder to him. Make sure we stay useful or he'll find another favorite. The politics of the Lotus Assassin Order are complicated. It's all right if murder is suspected, so long as it appears deserved because of incompetence. Well, okay. That is your task to figure out, Acolyte. This is a dangerous place. And Dog By is now outside Barkin. An accident that disgraces him. I, of course, must not be Don't know if you can hear it. Talk to my Acolytes at their stations in the Golem Press Room and the Soul Extractor. These are dangerous machines. Find a sharp corner Shin can crack his temple on. <laughs> Return to me when you have an idea for an appropriate accident. I don't care what it is. As long as there is a corpse for me to gloat over in the end. Okay then, man. Remember your tasks, Acolyte. Create a spirit shard in the extraction chamber for the Jade Golem. And find a creative way to kill and disgrace Master Shin. Well, we know where the you extraction chamber is. from Acolyte Trainer Guang. I'm sure you are her superior, but she might have something of use to you. God damn it, dog. Anyway... Yeah, so basically, um, first thing we're going to do is go over to that Acolyte Trainer. I did already get that, okay. Is it me or does the uh, does the bridge on the fucking mini-map look weird? I don't know. You, the person who I just stepped out. Gongs, hmm? So am I. Let's identify what training you need by sparring for a short time. Let's keep it non-lethal for now. To find you have enough enemies in this place. We acolytes are utterly expendable. 
All right. Good. Remember, no killing blows. I'm sure you'll have plenty of time to practice those later. And just for you, I'll use my claws. Yeah, she's not difficult at all. Wow, she's so shit. Okay. Okay, you just back him up to the corner. Yeah, it doesn't have the best battle combat system ever. But, no well. Bioware game. Well, you would appear to have more than a passing knowledge of combat. I could almost see some kind of flaw, but I was clearly outclassed. Yes, you were. I knew this acolyte was something special, but I didn't think my trainer would be made to look like a fool. You, New Blood, you will be the trainer now. When I am promoted, you will train all my acolytes. You, assist him if you can even do that. It would seem that you have taken over my duties. I will still serve as an advisor, as Master Gong ordered. There are techniques I can share. Sorry. <laughs> okay. I guess I apologize. In truth, I did not like being a trainer. Life for any of Master Gong's acolytes is rough and short, but especially so for trainers. Master Shin sees to that. My duties, your duties now, include training Master Shin's personal entourage. In the past, if a trainer was too good, Shin had that trainer killed to keep Gong weak. Well, that's shit. <laughs> I think one member of his entourage is a full Lotus assassin. I have survived by appearing unimportant and staying out of the fight between Gong and Shin. Oh, jeez, law quests. What training do you have? I have learned a number of techniques. Ooh, ice shard. Okay. Oh, 15,000, are you kidding me? That's not even that good. It's not good. Okay, we got some things I could buy here. Chi and focus. Let's get that one for 5,000. And I don't really see a point in getting the ones that give us a negative to something, so I'll just get that. Okay. Okay, so we're going to head over to that extraction room there. And we will fight those guys later on. Don't worry about that one. So, right, we are going over here, yes. God damn it, Zoo. You approach the soul extractor. The assassins want you to create a spirit shard to crush a life to power a golem puppet. They are very efficient in their brutality now. It wasn't always like this. Fear used to be the primary tactic. Destroy the family of one to ensure the loyalty of all. It caused chaos, uprisings, close allies turning on each other. Those inclined to betrayal fear it the most. Imagine if you could corrupt the machine and return the chaos of disloyalty the Emperor dreads. <laughs> Can I ruin their plans and get what I need? Motives. Helping the assassins harms you. If you corrupt the spirit shard, you can move forward while also crippling their golems. They seek control. There used to be a chance to disobey when the order given was too harsh. The victims pointlessly innocent. Now there is only obedience. There is something chaotic enough to disrupt that. In the elevator room to come, descend to the deepest mine, to the oldest graves. So I think just go. The thieves await you. Okay. Remember, <laughs> just go. Mines, no explanation. They are closed now for being too troublesome. That is where you will find what you need. And we should listen to him. So yeah, we're getting the soul extractor in here. Looks lovely. You must be Master Gong's latest acolyte. I heard there might be a new recruit, but they typically aren't ready for service so quickly. Stripping a will can take time. But Master Gong is known for being generous to those who please him. You must be quite exceptional to be allowed into service so directly. Yep. And, yeah, who's this I'm person? I'm a acolyte like you. My name Fine, is geez. unimportant. I have not yet earned the right to have a title. I must prove my worth through service here. This device is the soul extractor. 
It has a loftier name, but we are here to glorify Emperor Sun through death's hand, not pay tribute to some distant celestial lord. It is mounted on an elevator that reaches deep into the necropolis. Until recently, we excavated bodies to extract spirits that lingered near their graves. The results were unpredictable. Now we use slaves. Freshly killed spirits make the best golems. The more painful the death, the better. The extractor is not gentle. Horrible. If the Emperor really is behind this, he's a monster. Yeah, yeah, don't, sir. Uh, you okay. should get on with your work. Grand Whatever. Grand Inquisitor Gia is growing impatient for the Jade Golem to be completed. Select a suitable victim and create a spirit shock. Eight. So, do I just go here or what? Nope. So, do these doors lead anywhere? Probably not. No. You do actually have a name. What the hell? Elevator controls. Near surface mine level. We want to go to this one. You can get some loot on this level, but we want to go to You're the bottom. You're dead set on losing your life down in the lowest tombs. I won't stop you. I won't save you either. Oh, okay. And we actually do take it all the way down. We. I believe I want to exit to the west, if I recall. I'm pretty sure. Actually, I don't know if you could exit the other ways. The deep tombs hold malevolent spirits from a time when the Empire nearly fell. Chaotic and powerful, they hunger for revenge. I'm sorry, but I must be sure of what you are. Uh, okay. Uh, this guy uses the ice style as well, but doesn't seem that that bad. Ooh, he's got some maces as well. It's kind of interesting. Yeah, I think he... Does he have the Viper style? I think that's what it is, but... I don't know. Actually, I don't even know what... The Viper's the poison one, actually. I don't know what that is. Oh, what, you bitch? Oh, fuck. Why'd you do that, God? Oh, no, I'm fucking slowed. Oh, can I even use... No, it is immune, okay. Thought it would be, but, yeah. Fucking Macy's got that. You done. Why are you just following us? What the fuck? The assassins use slaves for their golems now, in part because of tombs like this. That was a remnant of the old empire, the spirit of an ancient invading horse lord. Zheng Sai, the tree that defies the fire, was one of many that threatened to level the Imperial City. The spirit monks, your people, stopped them, or so they claimed. I gambled that the vengeful spirits of these marauders would sense if you truly are a spirit monk. So many people are not what they seem to be. I had to be certain. Well, okay then. I had to be certain. I won't trouble you much longer. Now that you have disrupted Zheng Sai's spirit, you can take his body from his grave and use it in the extractor. Lovely. So yes, this is what we're Even meant to do. Even life, his kind were devoid of restraint. His spirit is pure chaos. A shard made using his ancient corpse will cripple the Jade Golem and those it commands. When you finish your master's other task, present the shard to earn passage to the inner chambers. Inside is the information you need to proceed to the palace. I, however, will not be leaving. Is that so? I will make that plain soon enough. Appease your master, 
When you are ready to enter the inner chambers, I will tell you why your success is so important. This fortress holds many secrets. Some are valuable, some are dangerous, and some are hidden because the dark is where they belong. Okay, man. But anyway, we go up to the back of this place and raid this coffin. And you automatically go back to the extractor thing here. What have you done? The machine is going crazy. You've corrupted it. Yes, I have. I can't let this continue. This area is my responsibility. I don't care who you are. And now she's going to fight us. But, oh well. Another acolyte dies. And we get the shard. Okay. Now, we can go back up to the, um, what's it, the other mine level to get some loot first. 